Uganda ya kutuzo lukungana lwa parliament za manga agari kama tuwale gabu ngeleza Urumuru ndi uruwabili umu samfu nga satu wakutuka nga mkaga januari umako guja Speaker wa parliament ya Uganda aneti ya nitamong bino ya bitegezi zaba na mauli liku parliament Na gamba lukungana lunu luwa kubela kuspeak resort ya mnyonyo It was decided in Australia that Uganda is going to be the next host And the hosting of Uganda is going to be from 3rd to 6th of January 2024. The composition of Cisco is of 74 presiding speakers and presiding officers arising out of 52 countries. And as we speak now, we have 42 speakers and presiding officers who have registered and who are going to attend this conference. Ona agambi enti emiramu ejigendo kogiru wako kwekuli obutonde buwensi parliamentary democracy engeli yoku biliza muentula ebi obula mune ebidala. We've been discussing about issues of environment in the house and one of the topics that we want to, to, to discuss in that conference is environment climate change and the role of parliament in preservation and conservation of the environment. These are things we've been discussing on a day-to-day -day basis. Then too, we have the diverse and inclusive parliaments, that is youth and gender sensitivity. You know in our parliament here we have the gender, we have the youth, we have the the old, we have the PW, this, so we are going to discuss about this. Then three, we have security measures for parliamentarians and parliaments. Then four, we have the health and well-being support in the parliaments and the role of speakers and presiding officers. And then finally, we have a special session on building consensus for parliament business and the role of speakers and presiding officers in ensuring that we have consensus in the house. You know the kind of houses that we are leading and the democracy that we believe in that should be always consensus built when we are having those Sessions. Speaker Agambi ente gwanga lya kuganyulwa mu lukungana runo gamba nga okuita mu bulambu zo kufuna ba musiga nsimbi ne bintu ebidala and the delegates plus their company persons will be able to get business opportunities from the country and identify and this also promotes our tourism because we have a committee of discussions headed by honorable chivalia you will be able to take most of this people to different tourism centers. You will find they will go to Kagulu Hill, they will go to well, source of the Nile, they will go, and that's all about money to the country. The hotel owners will be benefiting. They will get money being paid to them. We are not wasting in government money, but we have benefits that are going to accrue from this. Speaker since the day one, now we are going to be able to do the work we are going to do. We are going to be able to do the work we are going to do.